three years after people, the failed levees of Sacramento created a catastrophic flood on a scale matching Hurricane Katrina's destruction of New Orleans. But now, 10 years after people, an even greater wave of devastation looms. 20 miles away, the water level at Folsom Dam is dangerously high. Without people, the 1950s-era dam has accumulated silt and debris around the floodgate. The water is now about 400 feet higher in elevation than Sacramento. And a new winter storm is dumping water in faster than it can flow out. If the dam overtops, then as the water flowed around the sides of the dam, it would start eroding the abutments to the dam and could very likely result in a failure of the dam itself. As the churning storm waters erode the earthen sides of the dam, they pull down the rest of the structure. The avalanche of water and debris soon reaches Sacramento. The levees would be completely destroyed and overtopped. Water would flow through the entire city of Sacramento and probably all infrastructure within the city would be completely destroyed. At the airport, decaying planes are turned into projectiles, slamming into the surrounding buildings. 